Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to BioElite Wellness TV. My name is Joseph Martinez, stress relief expert and performance enhancement coach. Now today what I wanted to talk to you guys about today is a four ways you guys can uh, boost your immune function. Now your immune function specifically starts within your gut, okay? So if we are concentrating on the foods that we're consuming, we're really going to help boost our immune function. And we're going to help uh, our body be able to fight off all the harmful, you know, harmful intruders that come in specifically through our digestive function. It's also going to help balance out our hormones. It's going to help improve our overall health. All right. So with that being said, you know, the first thing you guys can do is stop taking in processed food. Now, processed sugar specifically. Now, processed sugar has been there's been studies shown that processed sugar actually it suppresses our immune function. Okay, for for a certain amount of time, depending on how much sugar you you uh, you consume, and also if you're eating a lot of processed sugar, it damages your blood sugar levels. Okay, it really doesn't allow them to stabilize. It makes them fluctuate, and when they fluctuate, your body excretes what is called cortisol from your adrenal glands, which causes a lot of toxic load on the body. Okay, so that's the second thing. All right, now the set, the first thing is, um, you know, the first thing is we want to eliminate those sugars from our life, and and, and what it does is it, it it raises our blood sugar levels, and then it damages our gut. Okay, now the second the th the second thing is um, avoiding the food intolerances that we eat. Okay, so uh, if we're everyone's different, every every uh, individual's different as far as what food they should be consuming, what foods they shouldn't be consuming, but the main food intolerances that I address with my clients is is uh, corn, soy, dairy, and lactose. Now these four specifically, a lot of them have some serious, serious reactions when they consume this and their, 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 their immune system is constantly um, fighting off these foods and it, it really hinders our gut, our gut function. All right, now when we hinder our gut function, we can't consume our, uh, uh, we can't absorb our food properly and then this it leads to a lot of other health ailments. All right, so if we eliminate the food intolerances, that's the second one. Now the third one is negative emotions. All right, now there's been studies shown that negative emotions actually do hinder our immune function because they're constantly you know, keeping our body in a very low vibrational state. Right now, our our body is vibrating, and if we aren't consuming the correct foods, if we aren't doing things properly, our vibration is going to lower, and this is going to it's going to hinder our immune response. Okay, I can go into more detail about this in another video, but this is extremely important to achieving optimal health because once we once we realize that these emotions that we're doing or we're having aren't are hindering our immune function, it's really going to help us. All right, now the fourth thing is sleep. All right, so there's circadian rhythms throughout the day. Uh, there are there are um, you know waves at which we're times we're supposed to sleep, times where we're supposed to go to bed. But a lot of people they don't even sleep. They can't even sleep properly because their body is so out of balance that they that their cortisol and melatonin levels, which are two different types of, of levels, cortisol is supposed to be start start higher in the morning and gradually get lower at night. So when you go to sleep, your melatonin levels come in, and your melatonin starts to help repair your body and improve, improve your immune function. All right, but if if we aren't sleeping at the proper times, if we aren't doing the proper things throughout that time, our immune function is going to suppress. And then we're not going to be able to have that equal balance. The melatonin is not going to be able to come in to fight off these harmful stressors. And it's going to be toxic, toxic, uh, detrimental, uh, harming, or det detrimental uh, you know, things that are going to happen to your body. Okay, so those are four things right there. Now, if we concentrate on uh, eliminating those four things and, and, and really concentrate on changing our lifestyle on that aspect, it's going to help improve our overall bodily functions and it's going to help boost our immune function. All right, now this is extremely important to eliminating stress and improving your performance. So if we, uh, if we, can, imp we, can, if we can improve our immune function, it's really going to really help a lot with that. All right, so but that's all for today. Uh, if you want to know a little bit more about me and what I do, please visit my website, bioelitewellness.com. I'll leave the link in the description down below, and uh, I'll be more than happy to help you guys out to, uh, to eliminate stress levels, to improve your health, to lose fat, and to honestly feel better throughout the day in the way you're, mo you're meant to feel. Okay, so uh, have a good one, and I hope you guys have, have a great week. Take care. Bye.